Hello and welcome to Pixel Aquarium. Today we're going to be drawing a sea lamprey. Sea lampreys are a parasitic species of lamprey which feed on the tissue of their host fish. They look a lot like eels, but unlike eels, of which some species have two jaws, these fish have zero. That makes them jawless fish, an ancient lineage which goes back hundreds of millions of years. In fact, the first fish were definitely jawless. So drawing this sea lamprey, I started out just uh, focusing on the strange mouth and the sort of long eel-like body of the fish. I decided to cut off most of the body of the fish because I like, just wanted to focus a lot on the front of the fish, the interesting mouth part, the sucker which it uses to feed on other fish by grasping onto them and sucking its tissues out. Uh, I was looking at some reference photos and they have these really weird like spirally teeth which go in a circle around their jawless mouth. It looks really interesting so I tried to recreate it here. It took a very long time to get the mouth to the final stage. I spent a lot of time just erasing the entire thing and starting over. Because doing teeth in pixel art is difficult, I think. It's tempting sometimes just to plop down like one pixel, but that doesn't really work. It doesn't really portray the sharpness of the teeth, and it's hard to portray how sharp the teeth are in pixel art, because when you're working with something that's such a small piece, of the uh, final fish, but it's also an integral part of it. So you're trying to do something with one, two, three, maybe four pixels, and you quickly run out of ways to make it look really sharp, because you're trying to make a pointed triangle that tapers off. So you'll see in the end I sort of went with this sort of L shape for the teeth, but you're supposed to see the corner of the L as the point of the teeth. So that's how I ended up solving that problem. I'm not sure if it 100% turned out perfect, but I think it was good enough. I like the way in the end that I sort of make the mouth spirally. Like just the uh, texture of the mouth spiral inwards. So I think that turned out well. Anyways, thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing for more fish videos every week.